What's up, YouTube, man? You already know what it is, man. It's your boy right here, Jaquel, man. Look here. Before I get into the video, man, I need y'all to do me a favor, a big favor, the biggest favor. Look, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be the first one to get our videos. And another thing, give this video right here a thumbs up and whatever you think, please say it down there below in the comment section. And don't forget to follow us on our social media in below. All right, so. Let's get into the video. First thing first, I want to say, I know some of y'all think me and Jai is not together. I know some of y'all think we broke up. I know some of y'all think uh, a lot of different other crazy, you know, thoughts that I had. To answer that questions that I just said, or to answer them, you know, that that, that thoughts y'all have, you know, flowing around in y'all minds. Yes, we are still together. We never broken up. The only way we breaking up is to them do us part. You get what I'm saying? We never broken up. That's my baby. I love her to the fullest, to the bottom of my soul. She loved me to the bottom of her soul, to the, with all her heart. We love each other. We are in love. We are a lovable couple. I love her to the fullest. She loved me to the fullest. We got a happy family. So, yes, we are still together. We never broke them right now. She just in Atlanta because she had to go back to take care of some business, some personal business. And I couldn't go because I had to stay back and work. So, right now, she's still in Atlanta. She just, you know, she took care of her business. Uh, uh, she's kicking it with her family because it's been a little bit since she's seen her family. It's been four months. So, which is understandable. I would want to, you know, stay there. Uh, if I had to go back, I want to stay there, you know, for a little bit longer to uh, kick with my family. So, she should be coming back soon. It's going to be a surprise because I don't know when she's coming back. She might just pop up on me and guess what? When she do, I'm going to record that moment because I know y'all miss her. I'm pretty sure she miss y'all. I miss her. I miss her. I miss my son. I miss all of them, both of them. I can't wait till they get back to me so I can hug them, kiss them, you know, do whatever. So, uh, yes. To answer that thoughts and questions that y'all had, that y'all, you know what I'm saying, never write down in the comment book, we all together. We never broke up. We never did break up. Um, so, yeah. Another thing is I want to hit you. Um, for everybody out there who thinks we're just perfect, never argue, never disagree, uh, uh, just, 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 just perfect couple. We are not. We have problems just like any couple out there. Jay-Z and Beyonce got problems just like any couple out there. Your favorite YouTubers have problems just like any couple out there. Yeah, we can get on camera and, and, and be smiling and be happy and be joking around and pull pranks and do this and doing that. But off camera, we have problems just like any, every couple not perfect so to to that being said um i'm not saying we we, we going through problems right now i'm not saying that but we do have problems like you know the couple basically what i'm trying to say i mean i, I you know i probably made that very quick but um yes mistakes was made during a relationship in the past i can't say that you know, I'm not going to say who made a mistake, but, you know, mistakes have been made. But guess what? As a level couple who we are, we, we, try, we try to, you know, build from that. You know what I'm saying? We try to move forward from that. We try to, we try to, we try to be a, a stronger couple than we was, you know, back in, you know, you know, a stronger couple than we was in 2016 and in 2013. You know what I'm saying? We try to be the strongest couple that we can possibly be. Not only for us, but for our son. You know what I'm saying? Because we do got a little boy now. It's just not me and her no more. We got a beautiful, handsome son. We got it both raised. We got it both take care of. I went into a household family. She went into a household family. We want some. Um, one of these days, I'm going to get down on my knee. I'm going to make her Mrs. Gangs. You know what I'm saying? She will be my wife. I'm saying that right now. I'm admitting to y'all. 
in front of the world, in front of you guys who's watching this video, to my family, from her family, she will be my wife. I'm telling you right there. I'm telling you right now. Am I happy for Christmas? Am I happy for New Year's? Am I happy for the next holiday coming up? You never know. I'm not telling y'all. I'm not telling her. But it will happen. It's going to be a surprise. And I will catch it on camera for y'all so y'all can, you know, experience that special moment. Not only for me, but for her as well. She will be my wife. But yes, we do got problems like any other couple. We do argue. Uh, the mistakes that have been made, we are moving forward. You know what I'm saying? We got, you know, I'm not saying, I'm not going to say and say we have no choice. But as a strong couple, because that is my soulmate. I'm pretty sure I'm her soulmate as well. As a strong couple we are, we talk about it. Then we do have a lot of disagreements about it, but we talking about it. We all get stronger from them arguments. I'm going to postpone that. A lot of people don't know now. Arguments make you closer to your spouse. Hands down. If you don't know that by now, then you shouldn't be in no, you know, relationship. Because um, that, that, that's, that's just really common sense. Arguments make you closer to your spouse. Why I say that? Because without arguments, if you're not arguing in your relationship, then your y'all relationship got a lot of secrets. Or y'all really don't care for each other like that. Or y'all, you know, don't love each other like that. Or either she might be cheating or he might be cheating or my y'all both might be cheating. I don't know. But if y'all don't have arguments in your relationship, then it's not real. Hands down. We have a lot of them. We, we don't argue because we hate each other. We don't argue because, you know, you know, we, we, we just, I'm, I'm doing this like she right here, but we not arguing because uh, we just want to argue. We argue because we love each other. Argument shows that y'all love each other. And, 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 I, and I really believe it. I believe like, yeah, we argue. Yeah, we might say some things or whatever, but at the end of the day, where is she going? Where I'm going? Yeah, we locked for life. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I got a name tattered right here on my wrist. She got a name. She got my name tattered on her hand. You know what I'm saying? So we we are not going nowhere. We, we, just, we stuck. We stuck here. We stuck together forever to the death do us part. You know what I'm saying? That's what it's that. So arguments do make us stronger. Arguments do make us a better couple and also a better parent. But we also, you know, have to, you know, take care of our, 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 our you know, beautiful, handsome, you know, boy. Saying we grown so fast, by the way, he will be one next year. You know what I'm saying? This he will be one in, you know what I'm saying, on January the third, man. You know, this is my favorite tattoo right here. As y'all don't if y'all don't know y'all can see, but this is footprint. That's his name and that's the year he was he was born and stuff like that. But yeah, he'll be one next year on the third, man. I can't wait. I'm I'm super decided, you know what I'm saying? Um because I'm I'm trying to go crazy for his birthday. This thing, I'm trying to make his thing as Anyways, yeah, we do have arguments, man. We do have a lot of disagreements. Disagreements just like any other couple out there. So that's just hands down. But, um, but we are moving forward from that. We are trying to better ourselves, not only as a human, human being, like, like not only, you know, for me and her, but for, 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 you know, parents. We trying to be better parents. We trying to be. Uh, uh, she trying to be a better Jai. I'm trying to be a better Jai uh, just, just, just for, just for the sake of us. You get what I'm saying? Uh, so yeah. So we do argue. We do have a lot of disagreements, just like everybody else out there. But I love her at the end of the day. I'm pretty sure she loved me at the end of the day. I love her with all my heart. She loved me with all her heart. I love both of them. My son. son, you know, get older. He gonna do anything for us, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, and all that. And plus, it's very important for us to have a two-parent household. I never had it. You know what I'm saying? If, if, if y'all knew my background, if y'all knew, you know, my past, whatever, I never had no uh, two-parents at home. Uh, household. I never had a one-parent household. You know what I'm saying? You know, to be honest with y'all, but that's another little conversation we can have later on in another video, but anyways, yeah, I do love Jai, 
y'all do love me. We not broken up. Uh, and also, we not perfect. But, but we are perfect. She perfect in my eyes. Excuse me. I'm perfect in her eyes. In her eyes, we perfect for each other. She perfect for me. You know, the days y'all probably can't stand by her, I can stand. You know what I'm saying? That's my baby. I love her. My, all my life. Uh, the days y'all probably can't stand by me, she probably stand. You know what I'm saying? Because she love me with all her heart. That's the most important thing in love. You don't love your spouse. You don't care for your spouse. If, if you don't treat your spouse right or anything, down that line, y'all, y'all, I mean personally, y'all probably don't need to be in them. Like I said, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You know, other other relationships are different. I'm not, I'm not trying to say and give y'all relationship advice because I'm still working on my relationship. Me and y'all are still working on our relationship. Not saying it's family. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying that at all because it's not. You know what I'm saying? If anything, it's progress. Progress from from, 2000, from 2013 to 2016 to now 2019. You know, here shortly. So I'm not saying a uh, relationship feeling because it's not. You know what I'm saying? We're doing better than we have been doing in, in the past years. You get what I'm saying? Um, but we do argue a lot. Uh, we do argue, in my opinion. You know, this is just me. Uh, some of the arguments can be petty, but that's all right. Though. Some of them arguments, majority of them are arguments are, you know, serious. So, but we do argue a lot. But at the end of the day, I know I love her. I know she loved me. She know I love her. And she know she loved me. So, you know, at the end of the day, it, you know, that argument don't really mean nothing. Um, so, yeah. Another thing is, she taught me. She taught me a lot, a lot, a lot. Um, most important thing, she taught me how to love, show emotions, and, and not afraid to express how I'm feeling. You know what I'm saying? And also, she also taught me how to expand my mindset, expand my thinking, expand how I look at it, you know, certain situations. You know what I'm saying? So, because um, honestly, when it, before I even got one, I never knew how to do it. I never knew how to expand. I mean, not expand, but express my feelings, express express how I feel, or even even know how to love at the time because of my past with you know, the, the, the uh, stuff I, had, I went through when I was, you know, coming up in the game. But um, but she taught me how to, she taught me all that. So she changed my whole mindset about a lot of things, a lot of things. Now I'm learning how to express how I feel, tell her how I feel, and I'm mad that I don't even have it. I'm saying I'm comfortable enough with her to do that now. And because of her, I think, you know what I'm saying? I'm very like she always think I take it for granted. She always think I'm not grateful. I'm pretty I appreciate I appreciate every single thing she's done. Cause honestly without her, without her being my rock, me personally, I probably would I 
think of man. So she, like I said, she told me a lot. Hands down, she gave me a lot. She taught me a lot, and um, she still here. That's my rock. You know what I'm saying? I'm her rock. You know what I'm saying? She my rock. I'm her boo, basically. You know what I'm saying? The difference is both is a rock. Both is a big rock. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, rock. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, yeah. Uh, and I'm pretty sure I taught her a lot. Then a lot of things too. I'm, I'm pretty sure I taught her how to see different things. And spare her mindset as well, you know what I'm saying? And all that. But uh, yeah, we do love each other, you know what I'm saying? Here's that. You know, we, we love each other a lot. I love her, I love my son. My son, like I said, my son, I guess, you know, big. Uh, he made 11 months this month. He turned one next year. And, you know, he getting big. We, you know, we, we gonna have a happy family, you know what I'm saying? Our first family Christmas, you know, with me. Jaya and uh, baby, you know, baby. So, you know, I, I'm excited. I can I can never be, you can't be happier than that, you know what I'm saying? That's all I want. That's all I need. That's, that's, that's only thing, you know, only thing I, I really, you know, need, really, you know, it's just something I can pick up. Because now, you know, her half my son, my first son, I have something to live for. Not saying, before he, you know, before she had him, I had nothing to live for, like, oh, I'm just gonna go crazy, you know, you know not, 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 not none of that, like, as far as that, I have something to live for, as far as and take care of, and oh, I gotta spend this responsibly, and I gotta do this for, you know, you know what I'm saying, things like that, you know, so I had something to live for, you know, like, I'm, I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm, I'm a proud daddy, I'm a proud father, yes, I was scared at the beginning, you know, when she told me she was Anyways, when she told me she was pregnant, yes, I was scared because I was 20 years old. You know what I'm saying? And she was 21 years old at the time and stuff. So, yes, I was scared, but, you know, that's my son.